Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day and checking out this video. This video is going to be a really big Bath & Body Works soap haul. I have an in-store haul and an online haul. And this online box, she's a big one. So, <laughs> let's get into it. Oh my gosh, it's really, really heavy. Okay, let's get into it. So, soaps were on sale for $3.95. I actually think I have to put this on the floor. That's how big it is. Oh, gosh. Struggle bus. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. My tablecloth is literally a mess. Oh, my gosh. This is what happens when you buy a shit ton of soap. I wonder if the label says how much, how many pounds it is. Mm, it was two, no, not two pounds. I don't know, but anyway, soaps. Okay, <laughs> now that everybody's clicked out of this video, great, thanks guys. Um, okay, this tablecloth is really gonna bother me. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Okay. There's like very few things that have to be looking cute and a tablecloth in a video was one of them. All right, so soaps, they were $2.95. I ordered some online because they had the Christmas soaps out and I had a 20% off coupon. So these soaps came to 316 online. I ordered some wallflowers, they came to 384 and I ordered some one wick candles that came to $8 after 20% off. So. Pretty good deals. Well, let's let's just get into it. <laughs> oh my god! All right, soaps. I don't think I'm gonna have time to like smell every single one of these, but we'll see. Sunshines and lemons, creamy luxe. It's yuzu, grapefruit, and sun rays. This really does smell very grapefruity. I'm not sure why it says sunshine and lemons, but it's very very grapefruit grapefruity. I like it. I wanted to get oh, a couple of non. Christmassy and fall ones just to you know create a little bit more of a backstock harvest gathering I'm gonna put this one out for Thanksgiving or closer to Thanksgiving fresh picked apples autumn berries and clove buds it's a really really lovely fall scent winter citrus wreath in the gentle gel balsam wreath fresh citrus and forest breeze super super Christmassy I love it. The green, it looks very chic with the gold. Love it. Flannel. Love the blue. They're going with a blue for flannel this year, which I'm not opposed to. Crisp Autumn Air, Heirloom Mahogany, and Cedar Wood. Just a super manly, cologne type of scent, but I don't mind that. You know, it's just hand soap. It smells good. Okay. I'm trying to bring them all out of the box. to do iced cinnamon rolls this is one of their Christmassy ish packaging I don't know there's not reindeer they're just deer so it works for whatever but I love the little sparkles now this this was confusing to me I did not read the scent notes before I placed it I was like oh cinnamon rolls duh it's warm cinnamon rolls fresh orange and sugar glaze it smells like straight up apples uh, apples oh my gosh it smells like straight up oranges there is no like cinnamon roll to this at all it, it just smells like orange it, I don't even know why they're marketing it as iced cinnamon rolls because it's straight up orange it's like a summer soap <laughs> winter candy apple a classic winter time scent I always love to put this out for February because it's red Valentine's Day it's a very bright scent sweet it's red apple winter rose petals and candied orange very very sweet candy apple scent, duh, candy apple, but it's just lovely to break up the, like, the heaviness of the winter and the gloominess, so I really like that for February. Toasted vanilla chai, whipped vanilla, sponge sugar, and winter spice. This one looks super nice. It's like a cream, tan, gray. I'm not really sure what color that is. <laughs> oh, this is nice. Very, very warm and cozy for winter time. Then we have coconut mint drop. I like this one a lot, love the green. The packaging is very busy with all this, but who cares? I, I just love the green, like the mint green. It's white coconut, iced peppermint, and winter musk. And this is just smells like an Andy's candy. 
yeah, very pepperminty. Woo, very good for around Christmas. I like that. Fresh Sparkling Snow. I actually wound up getting two of these. This is Icy Melon Holiday Pear and Falling Snow. I got two of these because I thought... I went back in an empties video and I really liked it. And I don't know if they changed the scent or what, but it is not what I remember. It's very heavy on the melon. It honestly just smells like honeydew melon. And I don't know if that's what it smelled like before, but anyway, I got two of them. Again, a nice scent to just break up the winter heaviness. Cactus Blossom. I love this pink. Oh, so gorgeous. Cactus Flower Petals, Sun Kiss, Coconut, and Sparkling Lemon. I love this scent. Even I'm not a floral lover, I still enjoy this. Oh, it's the coconut and the lemon that just saves it for me. It's so nice. I love that for springtime. Then a classic warm vanilla sugar in the Creamy Luxe. This is creamy vanilla, sparkling sugar crystals. Everybody knows what warm vanilla sugar smells like if you are a Bath & Body Works fan. So classic vanilla. Okay, we're on to the last little bit of the online soaps. We have fresh strawberry tart. This one's cool. Freshly picked strawberries, orange zest, and bergamot. Orange zest. It's hard. Mm, very strawberry. I love the orange. I love the bergamot. Nice take on a strawberry. Doesn't smell anything like strawberry pound cake, in case you were curious. Snowy peach berry. Snow-kissed cranberries, frosted peach blossom, and shimmering woods. This is hysterical that I bought this because, again, I didn't read the scent notes. I don't really like cranberry, cr cranberry, and I really don't like peach, but it smells pretty nice. I actually like that. And everything else, I hate cranberry and peach, but in the soap, it works. Another thing I hate in everything else except the soap is sweet cinnamon pumpkin. I hate this scent. It's Harvest Pumpkin Spiced Clove and Sugar Cane. This scent in candle is disgusting. I hate it. Anything else, gross. But for some reason, the soap just works. I don't know. And this is in the deep cleansing, so I'm really happy. Mm. I don't know why it just works. I'm very happy to get the one deep cleansing that they had. They, I, they may have had another one. I just didn't like the scent. But uh, the deep cleansing is my favorite over the gentle gel and then creamy luxe. Uh, my favorite is deep cleansing, creamy luxe, then gentle gel. In case you were curious. All right. So these four I have here are all going to be for gifts. So I got the foaming because I know other people really like the foaming hand soaps. I clearly do not like the foaming. So that's why I give these as gifts. I don't know. I feel like it's maybe a safer option. A lot of people tend to go for foaming, especially if they have kids, whatever. I don't know. But I got a vanilla bean Noel. The packaging is so cute. Love it. Another classic Bath and Body Works Christmas scent of fresh vanilla bean, warm caramel and sugar cookies. Super sweet, super, super, super yummy vanilla though. Then I got a gingham. I thought this was a nice classic looking scent. It's blue freesia, sweet clementine and soft violet petals. It's classic looking and then it's like a nice pretty fresh floral scent. So that's that. I got a strawberry pound cake. Fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, and whipped cream. Why did they not release the strawberry pound cake in the creamy luxe or the gentle gel? I'm curious. And then a frosted coconut snowball in this matte packaging, which is stunning. I love, love, love this matte packaging for the soap. It is gorgeous. Creamy coconut, whipped vanilla, and sugar crystals. I just love this scent. It's like coconut cream pie. It smells so good. And this is gorge absolutely gorgeous. So those are the gifts. <clears throat> Should they continue with soaps? Yeah, I guess so. I'll continue with soaps. So the rest of the soaps are <clears throat> soaps that I got in store and they wound up coming to probably the same price, right? Yep. 316 with my, I went in store and used a 20% off coupon. I was looking in store specifically for a Merry Cookie but they didn't have that. So I just picked up three that I couldn't get online that they either didn't have or I just didn't buy. So I got winter. This one opened, which is so annoying. This is spiced orange, fur balsam, and clove buds. Not my most favorite of scents. Winter is like, 
yeah it's not my most favorite i honestly i don't know why i got it i have to be honest i don't know why i got it i just love snow soaps all right frosty coconut snowball in the gentle gel i wish they would have done matte with this one but it's fine again same scent notes it smells like a coconut cream pie i absolutely love that one and then we have lastly frozen lake this one's pretty and the scent notes on this one are Frozen cypress, eucalyptus, and juniper berry. I thought that the candle has lavender in it too or something. Maybe I'm wrong. Mm, this just smells like almost manly, but super crisp and fresh. It just works. I don't know. Just works. All right. So that was it for the soaps that I bought. That's a lot of soaps. <laughs> oh my God. But for $3.16 when they retail for $7.50, such a good deal. Absolutely like perfect time to stock up. I should have honestly gotten more than just four to give as gifts, but I have a plan in place for those. So I'll go into wallflowers and candles. I only picked up a few, but I did get some. Also, side note, this is how they shipped my wallflowers. Just in this bag, no protection, no bubble wrap. Is this like the new way that they have been shipping wallflowers? I don't know. I haven't placed an online order in a really long time, but they used to send you these super nice uh, like plastic holders and they just came in a baggie. So I don't know. And laser ships shipped my order. So I don't know if that has anything to do with it or what, but anyway, wallflowers, they weren't on sale. They were just like the classic five for 24, I think something like that. But anyway, I got Mahogany Balsam. I don't have any holiday wallflowers except I think Tis the Season. Anyway, Juniper Berry, Fresh Balsam, and Mahogany Wood. I have a little candle of this, so I wanted to match that. I got a Sugared Snickerdoodle. Okay. Warm Spices, Creamy Vanilla, and Sugared Musk. I loved this candle last year. Figured can't go wrong. I got a frosted coconut snowball. Duh, it smells so good. I'm telling you, it's amazing. I got a frozen lake. Let's see if this one has lavender. It does, lavender leaves, cool eucalyptus, and juniper berries. Where's this one, did this? Frozen cypress, ah, different notes. Check your notes, people. They're trying to play some games with us. And then finally, I got a gingham. Which, so I'll tell you my plan once I guess to the end, I guess. Blue Freesia, White Peach, and Fresh Clementine. So that's it for wallflowers. And then real quick, I have two little one wick candles for the bathroom. I got the sugared snickerdoodle, which looks absolutely nothing like what it did online. Online, this looked like gold sparkles and it looks so beautiful, but this is just, hmm not for me and now they do not put notes on their one wicks in case you were wondering so just a heads up but yeah this packaging is so ugly but it smells so good mm, like cookies delicious delicious cookies oh my gosh running out of room and then a frozen lake they had another packaging of frozen lake but I just went with this one this one was way prettier it just smells gorgeous mm. oh I didn't check the wick Oh, this one. This one might have to be exchanged. The wick is a little wonky. Let's check the wick on sugar snickerdoodle. Perfect. Okay. Anyway, so yeah, check your one wicks, people. That's the only problem with the buying candles online and stuff is obviously you, you can't pick pick and choose. All right, real quick. I know I'm taking your guys' taking way too much of your time. So I also in store, I got some hand sanitizers and I used my free hand cream coupons. So the two hand sanitizers I got are Frosted Coconut Snowball and Vanilla Bean Noel. They're just the classic pocket backs. And the two hand creams that I got for right now, because they did not have any Christmas ones out, I got gingham and strawberry pound cake. So if you haven't already guessed, this is kind of like what I'm going to be doing for little Christmas gifts is, where's my, like I'm going to do a strawberry pound cake soap and then a hand cream and then a hand sanitizer if I can find it. If not, I'm going to be really ticked off because everything else matches. 
But anyway, so that's my plan. So same thing with the frosted, where's the, here it is. Same thing with the frosted coconut snowball. So frosted coconut snowball soap, sanitizer, and hand cream once they put out the Christmas ones. And then for the gingham, okay. The gingham I have, if you watched my last little video, like my super quick haul, I got a wallflower plug. So I'm gonna give this with the wallflower plug, the soap, the hand cream, and then also in that I bought some body care. So that'll be just like a bigger gift. I don't know. Or maybe I'll separate it into two separate gifts. I have no idea what's what I'm going to do. But anyway, that's my that's my plan. Someone was very rude and decided to call me. Anyway, as I was saying, just really quickly, I was just saying that's like what I do at the holidays, the quick little gift, you know, to give. It's something nice. It's something name brand, but it doesn't break the bank. You know, the soaps were three dollars and some change this was free and the pocket backs are only a dollar 75 but or dollar 95 sorry but i did get them cheaper with my coupons but how much did they actually the hand sanitizers came to a dollar 56 and then the hand creams were free so that's that and then they did give me two samples of you're the one which is white birch velvet velvety rose and a drop of strawberry nectar and then on the back of these is a coupon for a six dollar any body care item sorry i was reading it's off screen six dollar any body care item so that's cool i don't know i haven't sprayed it i'm a little afraid of the rose i guess we could spray it now okay it doesn't work there we go but they're cute they're little samples i really enjoy this i think this is a, a really great way to have a bounce back coupon, but also give somebody a way to try it instead of these because they constantly are shoving these in my face and I, I don't like it because most of the time they're giving me a scent that I know I don't like and they're like, smell, smell, smell. And I just, I don't like it. But these are a very cool way. Plus a bounce back coupon. This is the way to go. All right, this is dried down pretty much. Oh, that's rosy. <laughs> this is a very mature, scent oh i don't like that at all that is very rosy no 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 not for me but you do get like a little bit of the the strawberry i don't know again perfumes are also very subject to changing with everybody's different body chemistry so it could smell gross on me and fabulous on you but as for the rose i do not like it this is a very mature scent I think that if you have a teen or a young adult, you know, like 18, 19, they would not like this. But yeah, it's very mature. I appreciate the matureness, but I hate the rose. That's the that on that. Okay, that is it, you guys. Thank you all so much for watching. And if you stuck around to this very end, thank you. I appreciate you. Let me know down below if you guys partook in the soap sale. If so, what did you get? I'd love to chat with y'all. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye.